okay for today we will be continuing with the uh, exercise 9.3 linear equation to variables by substitution method okay as you can see from question number four we have we are given that uh, the first equation is 2x plus y minus 35 equal to 0 and the second equation is 3x plus 4y minus 65 equal to 0 so as you can see from the equation that the constant term in each of the cases are at the left hand side okay 35 minus 35 is at the left hand side and 0 is at the right hand side as well as negative 65 is at the right hand side and 0 is the right hand side okay so in this case i have to uh, modify i have to make a change in this equation okay before i do the calculation so here how it's done okay 2x plus y equal to so moving negative 35 to the right hand side it will become positive then this will be equation one okay and the next part is also as simple as that 3x plus 4y equal to 65 this is also equation two so as you can see from the next step is look at the equation carefully so i have the value of x here coefficient of x are 2 and 3 and both are positive and i have y and 4y okay so i have i can choose any of the two i can choose y to be exactly the same or x as the same okay so here i am choosing y because i have a simple number in front of y okay so i will be choosing y as are my main target so i will try to make these two similar so to make these two similar i have to cross multiply with the coefficient of y here coefficient of y is one here is four so i have to interchange that okay so this part has one this part has four so four will multiply this and this equation will be multiplied by one so i'm inter interchanging the coefficient here okay so i will write this down multiplying equation one by four and equation two by one we get so if i multiply equation one by four i will be having eight x plus four y equal to four five is a two in three 40 is a 12 140 this will be our equation 3 and as equation 2 will be multiplied by 1 so i don't have to make any changes it will become this uh, it will be as same as equation 2 this will be equation 4 so as you can see now we have similar y okay so we have similar y that means that i will try to make these zeros okay i have to I'll try to make these two uh, cross away each other okay but as you can see here both has positive sign if i use addition it will become 8y okay so i want to remove this so i have to use subtracting okay subtracting equation 4 from equation 3 okay. so i will rewrite the to the about the equation here for a better understanding In case of subtraction okay you have to change the sign of the second part of the equation always change the sign okay minus minus c plus will become minus plus will become minus plus will become minus okay if it is minus here it will change to positive okay so let's do the calculation here so 4y minus 4y is cancel each other 8x minus 3x is 5x then here 140 minus 65 10 minus 5 is 5 here we have 13 13 minus 6 is 7 okay so x is equal to 75 by 5 if i do the calculation here 5 1 is 5 5 5 is 25 so the value of x is 15 so i have the value of x so my next mission is i have to find the value of y okay so to find the value of y, I, I, I can use any of the four equations 
here okay so i will choose the simple one okay as you can see here equation one two three and four equation one is the simplest okay it is very simple if you look at the drum it is the simplest one so i will target this as my next mission okay so i will substitute the value of x that is 15 in equation one then i can find the value of y okay so substituting sub substituting equation uh, sorry x equal to 15 in equation one we get okay so we will substitute the value of x in equation one so what is equation one 2x plus y equal to 35 so 2x instead of x i have to put 15 2x okay plus y equal to 35 as you can see from this equation now we have only unknown value is y okay so that means that i can easily find the value of y here so 2 times 15 is 30 30 plus y is equal to 35 so i have a new constant term here so i have to put this constant term to the right hand side so <clears throat> that means that y will stay here by itself 35 minus 30 so <clears throat> the value of y becomes 5 okay so now we have figured out the value of x and y here so it's very very simple and you need a lot of hard work okay to be very very clear with it and hard work always pays okay remember that don't be lazy don't neglect your studies okay therefore x is equal to 15 and y is equal to 5 okay so i have the value of x and y now so <clears throat> what i want you to do is i want you to look at your textbook okay and look at my work here i want you to try it by looking at what i have done here then i want you to try it for around five times okay so for five times remember okay five times is very good five times is the term so practice 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 and try not to forget it read your textbook for explanations on other things so don't neglect your studies okay to be successful in life you have to uh, know everything okay try to know everything which is on your way so don't be lazy study hard and always pray okay so i hope you understand the lesson for today have a good day